polynomial in standard form. Whenever you write a polynomial in standard form, then all the terms are written in decreasing order of their degrees. We have four examples here. You need to write down all these polynomials in standard form and then write down the leading coefficient. Leading coefficient is the number associated with the term with highest degree. You can pause the video, copy this question and answer it and then look into my suggestion. So let's start working on these polynomials. The first one is 5x minus 2x square minus 3x cube. There are three terms in this polynomial. The third term has a degree of 3. Second two, first is 1. To write them in standard form means to write in decreasing order of their degrees. So each term will be written with decreasing order of their degree. Here, since the third term has the highest degree, it will be written first. So we can write this polynomial as minus 3x cubed and then minus 2x square plus 5x. So this polynomial is now written in standard form. Leading coefficient is the number associated with the leading term, the first term, when you write your polynomial in standard form. So the leading coefficient here is negative 3. Now let's do part B. In part B, we have a polynomial with two variables. Now here, let us calculate the degree of each term. 4 plus 1, 5. So the degree is 5 for the first term. 3 plus 3 is 6. And then we have 4. So clearly, that is the highest degree. Now whenever you have multiple variables, then you need to find number of factors of variables to figure out the degree of each term or you can add the exponents of variables. So we added 4 and 1 to get 5, 3 and 3 to get 6, 4 for y, correct? Now the first term should be minus x cube y cube. The second term degree 5 will be minus 3 x to the power of 4 times y and the last term in this trinomial will be 10 y to the power of 4. Whenever you write your polynomial in standard form, leading coefficient is the number associated with the variables of the first term, the leading term. Here it is minus 1. So minus 1 is the leading coefficient. Part C is 5x cubed minus 2x plus square root 2. Well, this is already written in standard form. Let's copy it as such. 5x cubed minus 2x plus square root 2. Here, the leading coefficient is the number 5. The last one here is in single variable. x cubed is the leading term since it has the highest degree, followed by x squared term, and then this is order is 0, right? Degree is 0, x to the power of 0. So we could write this as, now we'll divide each term by 2 and write them separately. So we have minus 3 over 2x cubed. That is our first term. The second term will be minus 6 divided by 2, which is minus 3. So we get minus 3x squared and 4 divided by 2 is 2 plus 2. So in this particular case, the leading coefficient is minus 3 over 2. So that is how we can rearrange the terms in a polynomial, write them in standard form. Remember, writing in standard form means we need to write the term with the highest power first and then with for lower degrees, right? So the degree of each term should be in decreasing order when you write the polynomials in standard form. Leading coefficient in that case, when you write in standard form, will be the number associated with the leading term, the first term. I hope it makes it very clear. Thank you and all the best.